Learn Inc. for engineering courses. Lead acid battery. In this video, we are going to learn about lead acid battery, which is a part of energy sources and storage devices under engineering chemistry. Construction, working, application. Definition The battery which uses sponge lead and lead peroxide for the conversion of the chemical energy into electrical power, such type of battery is called a lead acid battery. Construction of lead acid battery A lead acid battery consists of plates, separator and electrolyte hard plastic with a hard rubber case. Unit cell In the batteries, the plates are of two types, positive and negative. The positive one consists of lead dioxide and negative one consists of sponge lead. These two plates are separated using a separator which is an insulating material. The separator is made up of thin sheet of porous insulating material. Grid The grid frame is made up of antimony lead alloy. Container. This total construction is kept in a hard plastic case with an electrolyte. Cell connectors are used to connect the individual cells in series to give the required voltage. Positive terminal. Negative terminal. Cell cover. Cell cover has a hole into which a vent cap is fitted. Vent plugs. Vent plug has a vent hole for easy escape of gas formed inside the cell during charging. The electrolyte is the dilute sulfuric acid that is H2SO4 and the specific gravity of the electrolyte is 1.23. Now we will try to understand the principal working of lead acid battery. Working of lead acid battery a lead acid storage battery consists of a number of 3 to 6 voltaic cells connected in series to get 6 to 12 volt battery. Battery Function The electrolyte inside the battery cells react with the two battery plates. This chemical reaction creates electric current that powers the load. Discharge process When the lead acid storage battery operates, at anode, lead is oxidized to Pb2 plus ions and insoluble PbSO4 is formed. At cathode, PbO2 is reduced to Pb2 plus ions and PbSO4 is formed. Cell reactions At anode, Lead is oxidized to Pb2 plus ions, which further combines with SO4 2 minus forms insoluble PbSO4. Overall anode reaction At cathode, PbO2 gains electrons, that is, Pb undergoes reduction at the cathode from plus 4 to plus 2. The Pb2 plus ions then combines with SO4 2 minus ions forms insoluble PbSO4. Overall cathode reaction 
overall cell reaction during use that is discharge from the above cell reactions it is clear that pbso4 is precipitated at both the electrodes and h2so4 is used up recharging the battery the cell can be charged by passing electric current in the opposite direction the electrode reaction gets reversed as a result pb is deposited on anode and pbo2 on the cathode the net reaction during charging is application of the lead acid battery lead acid batteries are mostly used in automobiles For more engineering chemistry videos subscribe learning YouTube channel and follow us on all social medias